Dogecoin price to a dollar. What's it going to take? We were there before during the last pump, and I'm talking when we ran all the way up to 68 cents a piece. And a lot of people have been asking, hey, Mo, what's going on? Can Dogecoin run up to a dollar a piece or even more? The answer is a simple yes, but it's going to take a few things that I believe some people are going to get fired up over this others maybe not so much they see the writing on the wall if that these things happen it could explode up and there's a lot of things to talk about the dogecoin price prediction and we're going to do that we're going to look at the technical analysis of dogecoin right now dig into where it's at really go through it all and see what's happening now for those following the channel you know we've started the small account challenge if you have not done the small account challenge get over there uh, we got the Moo Moo. We're, I, I just bought my first stocks over at Moo Moo for those who are following along. Right now, look at this offer. The, you put $100 in using my link below. They're giving you f seven free fractional shares. But guess where they're of? Look at it. It's the Fantastic Seven. You get a little piece of all seven of them. Family, join below. I, am go I just bought my first stock over there. And I, you can watch my video before this one where I talk about that. It's big. We got big things happening with the Small Account Challenge. Get over there and my link to Weeble down below. If you sign up for Weeble, take advantage of the free stocks there. I bought some QQQ in there. That was a lot of fun. We got a lot of things going on. And of course, Code Mo is live again. It's been a while. MOE, get in there. Lifetime access to the course in the course Discord. That link's down below. Now, can we get Dogecoin to a dollar a piece? A lot of people are wondering that. They're talking about it. Hey, Mo, can Doge do this? Can Doge do that? Well, let's pull up the charts and see what we're talking about. One, I pulled up the five-year on this because I don't know if everybody realizes how close we got during the last pump. Uh, 68 cents a piece. Are we going to be able to pump up that high this time? Or is it just too much supply, not enough demand? You know, how's it going to go? liquidity in the overall monetary policy from the fed what's going on with the sec is everything a security there are so many things to consider but the answer the short answer is yes we can go to a dollar a piece again think about this let's put this in perspective let's pull up the chart all right and let's pull up the weekly chart to give you an even better idea so we know where how low we got Let, let's just say this was the cycle obviously it goes up a little bit higher up to 60 eight cents a piece but during this winter this crypto winter and these are weekly candles so there you don't need a lot of them here to find the bottom but during the 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 winter how low did we go what was the lowest mo right right here we had the dogecoin price go to basically 4.9 cents a piece that was it that was the bottom it went no lower and if you bought on this day right now you were up well let's see 400 over 400 percent right now you're loving life. You're you're moving up. You you know, you stomach it. You held your nose during the summer of 2022 and it took almost 2 years for you to start cashing in big time. And that's the thing. How long will we run? How high are we going to go? Are we going to see Dogecoin get to a dollar again? Well, the problem there's multiple problems. All right, we're going to go check out the the day candle on this as I, I talk about this and you guys hit the like button if you're part of the doge family down below put a comment how many dogecoin do you currently have are you selling dogecoin are you buying dogecoin what are you doing right now are you just gonna hold your dogecoin i want to know what people are doing with their doge and see where the community's at right now and for those who remember i always tell this story a million times over I was a part of the day one Dogecoin community of mining it. I was getting 200,000 Dogecoin a day mining. And now we know they create about 10,000 Doge per minute. Back in those days, it was even more, man. That was back when it was brand new. We were loading up on Dogecoin. Uh, but we didn't know it was going to get up to where it's at now, 20, 21 cents a piece, which is crazy. Uh, to think that it was up to 68 at one time as well. Dogecoin millionaires? I could have been a Dogecoin multi-millionaire if I would have kept them all. Uh, but I did not. I traded them in for my Bitcoin and then I got robbed, which is a whole different video. Like I said, I will talk about that video down the road. I will make a whole video on it and it still irritates me. So I haven't made the video yet. Back to Dogecoin though. So what do we got? We have some issues, multiple issues. One we're creating 10, I, I, these are all rough. Don't, don't 
come at me if I'm off this, uh, the calculations a little bit, but I believe we're creating around 10,000 doge a minute, right? And roughly the overall supply is what? 144 billion doge coin and roughly, I think we're a little under there. And you, you look at that and you think to yourself, okay, how high can the supply go? Well, it's unlimited. We can have as much as they print, as much as they make. And that I have always said is an issue. When you look at what Dogecoin is used for, what do we use Dogecoin? I remember back in the day, the Reddit community, when it first came out, we tried, tried to set up stores and we try to do all these things, right? And so it has become two main roads, in my opinion. One, you got, you know, it was always kind of, hey, it's like Bitcoin and da, 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 da. So it has that storage of value like Bitcoin. I agree 100% with that. I watched during the last winter, and we can pull up these charts, which we will. To me, the storage of value is a strong argument for this. But like I said, we have the unlimited supply, unlike Bitcoin, where we know it is fixed. And I would say, well, what about Ethereum? Mo? What's Dogecoin like Ethereum a little bit? Well, kind of, but no, not anymore. I'd say Ethereum changed an issue. One of the issues I always had with Ethereum was the continuation of having the overall supply going higher and higher and higher. Well, now it, we know it's deflationary and it's been dropping in overall supply. That's what Dogecoin needs to do. Dogecoin needs to get the development team around, set this thing on a path to become deflationary. If they can do this and you get in before all of this happens, I believe you're getting in at a good time. If it never comes to, it never happens. Well, then we know that it, the overall supply will continue higher and you're going to need more demand to make up for that. So there's a lot of things out there that could happen. But for Dogecoin to get to a dollar, the main thing is, I think let's turn this thing, have burning mechanism, turn this thing deflationary. Somehow, some way, make it deflationary like Ethereum is. Look what happened to Ethereum after that change. What happened? Well, we went from mining, you know, we have uh, we have proof of stake now. I'm not saying they have to go to that far route, but we need to come up with a mechanism that can burn Doge quicker than they're creating it. And that, my friends, would be huge. I think uh, it would be fantastic. So we can see where it's going to go. I'm just throwing, I'm spitballing here. I'm just having a talk. We're sitting around the water cooler wondering what can we do to get Dogecoin up to a dollar. Uh, will the Dogecoin price prediction come true of hitting new highs this bull cycle? I don't know, but we could pull up the charts, take a look at Dogecoin, see what's going on, and of course, make our best guess. You know, I don't have the crystal ball here, but like I said, if you like this stuff, hit that like button, hit the subscribe. We're going to try to make as much money as we can. We've been absolutely crushing the prognostications here on crypto. We've been doing very, very well. Uh, called for the pullback once we broke the Bollinger Band. It did. It pulled back down even a little bit more than I was expecting. Dogecoin price, we ran all the way up to roughly uh, Dogecoin. What did we get up to? About 21 cents almost. And then it came all the way down. I thought the base, the support for Dogecoin price would have been 13.13 cents. We actually got down below the 50 to 12.2 cents. So the Dogecoin price prediction I had probably wouldn't have been down quite that low, but it was only there for a couple hours. Boom, it pops up. We blow through the support back up to the resistance, blow through the resistance. And now we're, we go above the 14.5 cents a piece. Now let's fast forward to where we're at. Well, a lot of people are seeing what happened here with the latest run. I said, if we broke, if we broke Right here, the 14.5999, it's good, but the main one would be right here at 16 cents. If we got above 16 cents, expect this to absolutely get new highs. It did, and then from there, it went all the way up to almost 23 cents a piece. Now, we're all caught up on the Dogecoin price prediction, but where's it go? Where's it go now? So, we hit all of these so far, and now you're seeing a very similar look here. You got this flag and a little sell-off. We got this flag, and what didn't we have yet? This little sell-off. So let's go ahead and pretend, and it is a new run here. So we go to the bottom of the wick, put up the retracement. Where should we go if we retrace down like the last time we had this big run a couple of weeks ago? Well, 
We went all the way up. We hit it up there close to 23. And if it retraced down, it would go to 17.58 to 16.33 cents a piece. That's my Dogecoin price prediction uh, right now. Will Doge go there? I don't know. But if it does, I wouldn't be surprised. So I wouldn't panic until it broke through 16.33 cents. But remember, this one broke a little bit, but the next day it was up. So you might want to give it a day or two. But, you know, crypto is so volatile. It's crazy out there. So that's my Dogecoin price prediction based on what I'm seeing. Uh, the downside, I told you where we could go. That's my worry, my line in the sand for worrying. What you need to see for the next big run, and I mean the big run because I think you go to 29 to 35 range, is to break 22, basically get 23 or above and confirm one candle. Boom, we're off and running. I think we're off to 29 to 35 range. That's what I'm seeing for the Dogecoin price prediction. I think Dogecoin has a chance to explode 200% up back to those highs if we get a good momentum during this bull cycle. But to hit Dogecoin to a dollar, I definitely think we need to turn this thing deflationary one way or the other. And, of course, to have the SEC make some decisions on what they're doing with all those cryptos, including my Ethereum, and just see what's going on because there are a lot of things going on out there. Let me know what you think down below. But I got to tell you, family, if you have not done it, there are ways to stay in contact, see what I'm buying and selling. And, of course, you can come on over to the Stockmo Patreon right now. You can hit the Join button down below your YouTube here. There's a little button. If you want to see what stocks I'm going to be buying for the Small Account Challenge, you can join the Stockmo Patreon. I'm going to put it in the videos in the afternoon. If you want to know up to the moment, though, you join the Patreon. Or you can join down below, like I said, the button, uh, any level. I'm sharing that with that. But if you want to see my overall portfolios and everything I'm buying and selling, you got to join the Patreon. If you want to talk to all four of us in one place, come on over to the Stock Squad as well. we got good things there. And get code MO in there, M-O-E. Join the course today. Huge savings, limited time. Take advantage before it expires, family. we got good stuff happening. All right, and get your free stocks. Unbelievable right now. Uh, all you got to do is deposit $100 or more using my code below and get yourself set up for the small account challenge. I have a whole video on it. Check it out down below. Just click on my channel. You'll see the video. It is huge. It's going to be fun. All right, that's what I got for you today. I appreciate you stopping by. Let's get out there and make some money.